Hey guys, Joshua here, and oh man, 2019 has been such a rough year, and I, th I decided to just end off the year with just one last video. Well, this is not going to be my last video of 2019, I'm going to upload one more like in my last video of 2019, but this is just my last like normal video of 2019. Alright, so, it's been like 2019's about to end, it's been kind of a rough year, I'm not going to lie. So... As you guys know, I'm a huge Nintendo fan myself. I, I, I really love Nintendo because they make really awesome games. They make awesome consoles. And they literally made even the best Nintendo console ever imagined. The Switch. It's, the Switch is literally still a success throughout all these, all these, like, it's, it's like three years old and it's still a success. That's why I really love this console because it's like really awesome. I, I just love it. It's, it's awesome. But now, after playing the Switch for like three years, there's just been one question on my mind that I don't know if I'll get the answer to, and that's, what's next for Nintendo? What's going to be their next console? What's going to be their next big game? Yeah, so, you guys already know, I'm a huge Nintendo fan myself. I love Nintendo. I love Mario. I love Link. I love Kirby. I love pretty much anything Nintendo-related I would play. So, yeah, and... You guys know I'm just a huge Mario and Nintendo fan, and of course Sonic, of course. So yeah, the Nintendo, they they never let us down. They, they're like a Nintendo is literally like a huge video game company. They they have they're like a million dollar video game company. They make like a lot of systems like the 3DS, the Nintendo Switch, the Wii U, the Wii, and and lately the Switch Lite, which I really find to be a big piece of trash. But, yeah, that's that's kind of Nintendo's newest console. Well, it's not really a new console because it's literally just the, the, nor the, the normal Switch, but you can't switch it. It's, it's a Switch that can't switch. I, I'm not going to buy the Switch Lite. I'm never going to buy it because it's just, you know, I mean, th th we're not going to talk about the Switch Lite in this video. We're just going to be talking about Nintendo and what, what they're planning to do. So, we're, we're kind of going to get off topic here, but... You guys, of course, know Microsoft and Sony. Sony made the PlayStations and Microsoft made the Xboxes. So now Microsoft and Sony have now made new PlayStation and Xbox consoles. Microsoft made the Xbox Series X, which was announced in the Game Awards. And Sony announced the PlayStation 5, which I have no idea when it was announced because I don't really keep up with Sony and Microsoft lately. I don't really keep up with them, but I just try to keep up with them to see if they, like, make something new. And right now, they already did make something new. They they made the PlayStation 5 and the Xbox Series X. So, now Nintendo Nintendo's probably going to, probably has to make a console. I mean, not really, but, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure the Switch is probably going to still, like, keep up with Xbox and PlayStation, but... I'm just kind of worried that Nintendo might not, um, like, make, sell, sell as much as, like, with Xbox and PlayStation did. Like, the PlayStation is literally a hit. It's literally the best console ever. I'm not a big fan of it. And, but, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm more into Nintendo and Sega. And those, those I'm interested. I mean, I, I have played PlayStation games a lot and Xbox games. I even have an Xbox 360, which is, in my opinion, the best Xbox console. But, like, not really, I'm not really a big fan of the Xbox, but... Yeah. I just, I, I, I wonder, I just wonder what Nintendo will do next, because we already have a bunch of great Nintendo consoles, and the, and the Switch, lit, it literally, is like, it, ha, it has the two best things. It has, it has the ability to play on, like, a beautiful HD TV, or you can just take take it out of the dock and just play it wherever you want to on the go. I love doing both of those, but with when with Nintendo, they might make a like in a few years they might make a new console. I don't know what it's gonna be, but in a few years they might make a new console. But with the Switch having the feature to play on TV and playing on a handheld console, what can be better than that? I mean, we li we we literally have the be the best thing we can play on a on a beautiful TV. We can play on we with we can play in handheld. We can do two things with this system. So what can be better than that? What can be all better than that? I mean, I'm just I'm just I'm just repeating myself. I keep saying what can be better than that? What can be better than that? But it's true. Like what's going to be better than 
playing on a TV and playing in handheld on one console at a time. So they probably, I don't, I mean, I don't think we're probably gonna get a new 3D, like new DS anytime soon because the 3DS is kind of dead now, which is just kind of sad. But I think it has been confirmed that Nintendo said the 3DS is not dead, and I really hope it doesn't be get dead because the 3DS is actually a really awesome console. I have mine right here, the 3DS, the, the new Nintendo 3DS XL. I, di I didn't buy the new 2DS XL because it's the same, pretty much the same with the Switch Lite. Because, like, with the three, like, what, 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 what I kind of have a problem with, with Nintendo is that they just make new consoles out of old consoles. Like, with, with the 3DS XL, they now make the 2DS XL, and recently we've gotten the Nintendo Switch and then the Switch Lite. Like, I just, Nintendo just keeps on rehashing ideas, like, like, with the DS, like, this is just, this was like a few years ago. Like, when, when they made the Nintendo DS, they now made the Nintendo DSi, then, then the Nintendo 3DS. And then with the Wii, they now made the Wii and then the Wii U. So, it's just, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, they kind of like make new ideas. And I, I don't hate Nintendo for that. I really, really don't. I mean, they are some good ideas. Like, with the DS, just like, playing in a, like, in two handheld screens. And now with the 3DS, we can now play in two handheld screens in 3D, which I, I kind of don't really use the 3D effect on the 3DS that much because it just hurts my eyes using it. And with the Wii, it's like play, playing with like these like two separate controllers, like with like with line connected to like both of them, like with the Wii remote and nunchuck. And then with the Wii, with the Wii U, it just had a giant Wii U gamepad, which. A lot of people d don't, didn't really like the Wii U. The Wii U was kind of a failure. I disagree with that. I really thought the Wii U was an awesome console. And even if it wasn't a great console to all you Wii U haters, it did have some good games like Super Mario 3D World, Super Mario Maker, Mario Kart 8, Super Smash Brothers for Wii U, and just... Yeah, and, and with the Switch now, it's literally such a huge hit. Like, it has games like Super Mario Odyssey, which is my most favorite Switch game of all time, Luigi's Mansion 3, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, and even The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild 2, which we'll, I don't have no idea when we'll get information on. But what I really want to see in the future is a lot, like, like, we're, like, we're kind of, we're kind of getting a lot of sequels here. Like, we're getting The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild 2, which, is kind of a sequel. But, what, what kind of, like, we're, like, get, like, gets me, like, really excited for some reason is that since we got a sequel to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we might get a sequel to Super Mario Odyssey. Like, if, if we got a sequel to Super Mario Odyssey, I would have never been so happy in my life. Like, Super Mario Odyssey, it's the best Switch game ever. It's the best sand, it's the best Mario game ever. The bit, it's like a sandbox Mario game, like getting a lot of moons. There's so many beautiful kingdoms you can explore, especially the Metro Kingdom. The Metro Kingdom is my favorite ki kingdom in the game. So, if we got a sequel to Mario Odyssey, it would just be, I mean, all good games don't need sequels really, but, the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild was a beautiful game, and that game's getting a sequel, too. But there are some games where Nintendo's just leaving out, like um, F-Zero, that was a, that's a dead franchise. Earthbound is a dead franchise. But what about Pikmin? When are we going to get a new Pikmin game? Is Pikmin a dead franchise, too? The last Pikmin game that we got was Pikmin 4 on the Wii U. And are we ever going to get a new Pikmin game for Switch? I really hope we do because I'm a huge fan of Pikmin. And especially with Animal Crossing New Horizons. It's been a while since we got a new Animal Crossing game. And now we finally have one, which is Animal Crossing New Horizons, which I'm really excited for to play. And, yeah, and when are we going to get a new Kirby game? We, I mean, oh wait, yeah, we had Super Kirby Clash, which is kind of new, I guess. But, yeah, what about one... There's just one game that Nintendo still hasn't given us information on. And that's Metroid Prime 4. I, I don't even think Nintendo's gonna give us Metroid Prime 4. I think they just scrapped Metroid Prime 4 and just forgot about it because, like, would it really take, I mean, they gave us like a development update at the beginning of 2019 and we're literally at the end of 2019 right now and they still haven't given us an update. I mean, like, I know, I know Nintendo makes less, like, a lot of game. We just, I mean, I just try to enjoy Nintendo as much. I'm not, like, 
one of those specific Nintendo fanboys that just give like like give out everything and just give out honest opinions and stuff. I just like I just really love Nintendo for everything they do. They're like a beautiful video game company. I love Nintendo, but what what's gonna be next for them? I mean, what what's the new console gonna be? What's the next ge- next Mario game? What's the next? Zelda game, what's the next Pokemon game? Well, Pokemon Sword and Shield, yeah. But, like, what's gonna be next for them? Like, 2020 is probably gonna be another huge year for the Switch, because we're gonna, like, gonna get all these new games, like Animal Crossing New Horizons, hopefully Breath of the Wild too. but I hope we get a new Mario game, so, I mean, I, I don't want any Mario game to be better than Odyssey, because Odyssey is the best game, Mario game ever, because it's like a new sandbox Mario game. I, I was literally just playing the game just now, because I just really love the, I just really love Nintendo for all they've done. But I wonder what's just gonna be next for them, because we just have so, so many ideas we can give them, so many like new, you know, console ideas and games and stuff. But I just really wonder what's gonna be next for them. I don't know. I mean, I don't think there can be a console better than the Switch, because I, I love the Switch. To show you all my love for the Switch. I don't know, I didn't really kiss it, but you guys just... You, I, I just really love the Switch a lot, but if Nintendo makes, like, a new console, it'll probably... Lo- I'll probably love that new console, too. Not the Switch Lite. The Switch Lite's just a smaller version of the Switch, which I will, which I will not buy. But, I, I, I just, I'm just like a huge, I'm a huge Nintendo shill, and I just, like, I would just do anything for Nintendo. I really hope they don't go out of business one day. Like, if Nintendo went out of business one day, that would be the most heartbreaking thing ever. Like, I hope Nintendo, I, I just hope Nintendo can just sell more than Microsoft and, and Sony, because the PlayStation 4 was a huge hit. They, they, like, they, like, made so many versions of the PlayStation 4, like, the regular one, the PS4 Slim, and the PS4 Pro, and, and with the, same with the Xbox One. They first made the Xbox One, then the Xbox One S, then the Xbox One X, and now the Xbox Series X, and now with Sony, they made the PlayStation 5. So, will, will the Switch probably still keep up with them? I mean, the Wii U was still, like, going ahead with PlayStation 4 and, uh, and the Xbox One, and since Nintendo now made the Switch, and Sony is kind of making, Sony and Microsoft are making new consoles, I think it would be kind of fair, but, I don't know, I mean, I just hope Nintendo sells more than them, like, Microsoft and Sony, meh. I just hope that, I really hope Nintendo can sell more than them, cause I know, I, I can already tell the Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5 are gonna be huge hits. They're like gonna be like really big hits, but I just hope Nintendo can like keep it up. I mean, they'll probably have to lower the prices for Switch games and the Switch, like make it $200 instead of $300, or they'll probably have to make a new console. I don't know what they're gonna do, but only time and, and, and Nintendo will tell. At, at at the at the end of 2020, we'll probably get a new Nintendo console, which I really hope not now because the Switch is like three years three years old now. It, we have to wait like six years or seven years to get a new Nintendo console because by that time by that time the Switch would probably be dead, like the 3DS is now. I just really hope the Switch doesn't die. I hope the Switch like still makes video game consoles. I mean. Video game comes. I, I hope it still like makes a lot of games. Like it, there's Nintendo is still developing games for the Switch now, and I just I, I don't know. <laughs> I just the the Switch is an awesome console, and Nintendo. I really love you. I really love all the games you. I I I, I love Nintendo. It, they were actually the first video game. Well, the first video game I played was Sonic Rush on the Nintendo DS. Which so. The Nintendo DS was my first console ever playing, and I grew up with it a lot, like playing Sonic Rush, New Super Mario Brothers, Mario Kart DS, all those games I grew up with, so I just love Nintendo, I love for everything they've done. I've gotten the DS, I've gotten the 3DS, I got the Wii, the Wii U, then the Switch, and just like, and the DSi, and just stuff, so yeah. Alright, so that's pretty much it, so... Let me know what you guys think Nintendo will do in the future, and let me know what you think about what the, what the, like, about the Switch and stuff. 
All right, so I just I just wonder what's gonna be next for them. Like, what are they gonna do? What's the new console gonna be? Like, what's what are the new games coming in? Are we gonna get sequels? Like, lots of sequels to old games. Huh, but only time and Nintendo will tell. All right, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out. Bye.